The Southwest Florida Workforce Development Board presents the 2016 Awards Ceremony. The Champion Awards are in recognition for accomplishments far exceeding expectations. Worked with the school district and dating back to the in-school youth program and would work our high school age students in the maintenance department during the summertime. His work ethic and his leading by example really rubs off on these young kids. If you had a father that brought you up and was hard on you, made you work, but yet loved you and mentored you in only that special way, that's what Al does for our students in Glaze County. And you would think that he's just worried about the buildings. His number one goal is the education of our students. And I cannot think of a better person to recognize for this award. And Glaze County is truly grateful to have him. And I just want to thank you for everything you've done for our students. Thank you, Al. I'd like to say thanks to uh, Mr. Bass, Superintendent of Glaze County School, for working together. Uh, the staff that we get in the summertime to help us out during the summer, we really do appreciate them a lot. We don't mistreat anyone. We try to uh, mold them and teach them different techniques, different uh, skills in air conditioning, electrical. Uh, we find out that the young group of uh, students that we get during the summer, they have really don't have skills, and sometimes it's it's time consuming when you get skills, and yet you're trying to run a whole school district. You got seven or eight of them. You got to manage those two. But we find out that uh, talking to them in the morning time and counseling them, they really enjoy it. And we tell them, you know, it best to be five minutes early than be ten minutes late. And then they they respect that, and they're there, and they're 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 willing to work, and they really do put out. And we appreciate what they do. Thank you to the board. Uh, greatly appreciate this honor. Um, it's a pleasure working with D in the Naples office. Uh, the great part of my job working in human resources is providing opportunities and careers for young adults and uh, we're looking forward to building the relationship more with the Naples office as well as our Fort Myers office with Career Source and also our Sarasota office. So we greatly appreciate it and thank you very much. Okay. You know obviously appreciate the support of the Career Source group. Um, was proud to say we had another uh, hiring event with our friends over there in Fort Myers earlier this week, had our recruiting manager over there. Um, I approved seven more offers this morning before I uh, headed over this way. So really appreciate the help and support um, of the group. Obviously, we've got some pretty significant growth plans. Um, our business and what we do, we don't have to be anywhere in particular. We move freight for thousands of customers all over the world, but the great thing about it is we can do that from a wonderful place that our, our employees love to live in here in Southwest Florida. And, and again, it's one of the reasons that we've made this commitment to this area to continue to grow out. Um, while we do have other offices around the country um, and the globe for that matter, uh, this has been a great place and a great partnership and we really appreciate uh, all the help from Career Source and, and all our good friends here in Southwest Florida. So thank you all very much. Achievement awards in recognition of personal accomplishments far exceeding expectations. I just want to thank the Lord for allowing me to be here this evening, and I want to thank the Career Source Southwest for funding me and the Mockley Foundation. Also, um, farm worker career development, because without them, I wouldn't be where I'm at, you know, for schooling funding. And I also want to thank my parents for supporting me, because without them, I wouldn't be where I'm at. And uh, thank you. I appreciate this reward. Thank you. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Um, I'd like to say uh, thank you for having me out here today. Um, I'd like to give a big thanks to Career Source Southwest Florida. Um, without them, I wouldn't have been able to complete the uh, last year, and I wouldn't have graduated. I wouldn't have been up here today. Um, I'd also like to thank uh, Miss Angela Solomon for her hard work and dedication for allowing me to push through the uh, last few semesters of. Uh, the program and helping me get all my stuff together to follow through with this. Um, most importantly, I'd like to thank my fiance Chelsea. Um, she is my rock and my hard place, and throughout all the bad times, and she's been there with me for the good times. So I love you and thank you very much. You know. In summer of 2013, I returned from Tallahassee, wanting to complete my education so that I can begin my nursing career. After choosing a program that was right for me, I decided to enroll at. 
Cape Coral Technical College in April of 2014. Among other things, I ran into financial difficulties and got re recommended to the Southwest Florida Workforce to apply for assistance. I got assigned to Ms. Helen Kanakosa, and from that point on, she and Southwest Florida Workforce made an impact on my life. It was the middle of the practical nursing program, I began to get discouraged due to the rigorous coursework and other unforeseen circumstances and thought about giving up. Through prayer, encouragement from my parents, and Ms. Kanakosa, I traded my insecurities, worries, and doubt for faith, determination, and positive thoughts. The Florida Workforce has invested in me by providing me all the tools necessary to be successful. So I cannot be ungrateful, nor can I fail. Graduated from the program, approximately a week later, I passed my NCLEX and obtained my nursing, nursing license. Gain employment at a rehab in an ICF facility as a licensed practical nurse. And I am currently pursuing my associate degree to become a registered nurse. My five-year goal is to obtain my bachelor's degree then a master's to become a certified registered nurse anesthetist. I can truly attest I am a Southwest Florida workforce and career source Southwest Florida product. Thank uh, the Southwest Florida Workforce Development uh, Board and each and every partner that helped make this program possible. I wanna thank Mr. Joe Wheeler. Uh, the president, I want to thank Mr. Joe Paterno, the executive director, and I want to especially thank Ms. Judy Armstrong from Career Source, Southwest Florida, for all the support that she provided to me. And last but not least, I want to thank my girlfriend, Valmi, uh, for supporting me along this journey. June 19, 2015, I graduated with an associate degree in respiratory therapy. Uh, someone once said, when you, can't, when you cannot breathe, nothing else matters. In the hospital where I work, when somebody cannot breathe, the first person you want to see is a respiratory therapist. Thanks to the good works of Southwest Florida Workforce Development Board, uh, the amazing and dispensable partners and all the staff, Southwest Florida can count on one more respiratory therapist. Thank you. Workforce Development Board doing business as Career Source Southwest Florida is proud to be able to provide employment and training programs. The board has also been instrumental in obtaining additional funds through competitive grants for a myriad of services implemented in Southwest Florida. We extend a sincere congratulations to you.